um, memories of the fair was, uh, we lived in Holland Street, which is not far from where the fair was, at the bottom of our street. And we used to see the fair coming in. Um, it would come in uh, mostly on a Sunday. And, um, and we used to see, I think it was the big like, um, diesel or uh, the trucks they had were called scanners, I think. And they had names on them, like Lord Nelson and et cetera, et cetera. And we used to beg them, that's mine. And, you know, your friend would beg that one, you know. And it was great fun, you know, to watch them and that. And um, as a child, we used to run errands for the uh, fair people, you know, do shopping for them, et cetera. And a neighbour of mine, when we lived in Holland Street, she did washing for them. And, uh, but she only had the old-fashioned flat iron. Uh, my mum had electric iron, so she ended up doing all the ironing for them, you know. I think they gave her a pack of cigarettes in those days, <laughs> which was quite pleasing. Um, oh, well, when we used to go to the fair, as you say, at the beginning of the fair was mostly the um, like hoopla stores and uh, penny slot machines and that sort of thing. And because um, we didn't have much money in those days, and I can remember standing watching people playing the uh, penny machines, and they, and they didn't give them the winnings, they'd walk away. And the fair person would give us the winnings, you know, and it was great. We had, you know, fropping to spend. It was great fun, you know. So it's, uh, um, also, um, the local, when we got older, the records that they used to play, because they, there wasn't a, a Radio 1, etc. It was a light program, home service, and they never played music on them. But at the fair, they played the latest records. And also, we were just down by the bumping cars watching them, you know, and listening to the records. Also, in later years, when I was in... Uh, working in retail was in the clothes shop in the high street and um, the fair people used to have a dance on Tuesday night at the Forester's Hall, which is now Iceland. Um, and uh, the, the mums used to come in buying them clothes to go to the, the, you know, I think we were one of the few towns that gave them a, a dance. So they used to buy them new clothes to go to the dance, you know, and we took quite a bit of money from them. You know, it's, uh, I can remember, I think one night, um, uh, we only had, I only had six months to spend, which is one ride. And I can remember going on with a girl that lived in our street, and she took my money, and she dropped the sixpence, and it went through the floorboards. And uh, she said I had to get off because it was my sixpence that she dropped. And she went on the ride, and that was Ark, I think it was. And I had to stand watching her, you know, so it's, um, that does stick in my memory. <laughs> Yeah. I think on a, it used to open on a Wednesday. In those days, it was on a free day fair, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Uh, and, and I was in the Blue Coat School down on the front, and we used to have the day off. And we'd stand outside to see the glove come out the window of the guild hall. And then we'd go around, you know, with the mayor, etc., you know, as they proclaimed the fair. And then go on the rides down the fair, you know. So it's, um, sometimes it would be free rides for the first hour, but not always, you know. So it's... Um, you get on and they charge you and you have to get off again, you know. It's, 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 uh, um, as I say, on a Saturday night, they used to have the, uh, the stalls in the market because uh, there was no fair on a Saturday night. And I think you had to pay sixpence to go in, you know, which went to charity. Uh, and then there usually was a big dance at the Queen's Hall, as we called it in those days, you know. So, so it was a big event. Uh, also, I can remember it being in business uh, we used to have the farmers come in to buy their clothes, house tree jackets, etc., etc. Uh, Easter time, and they used to say, put it on my account. And it was a tradition to pay their account at Barcelona Fair time. You know, come into the town, bring their family in, and pay their account. Ask them for a discount for cash, you know. So <laughs> Once a farmer, always a farmer, you know. <laughs> okay, then. Yeah. Yeah. The original fair was a three-day fair, and uh, I think one day was a horse fair, and then it was a sheep fair, then it was a cattle fair each day, and that's why the farmers traditionally came into Barnstable, you know. So it's a, it, you know, it was a big event, you know. So, yeah, and of course on a Saturday we had the carnival as well, you know, it's, um, which again was a big event. I mean, people would be four or five deep on the pavements watching, you know. It's, uh, um, today I don't think it's like that. <laughs>